What's going on, guys? It's early product news. This video is coming to us from the notorious Leon Valley, the epicenter of tyrants. Leon Valley is constantly in the news for doing something shady, corrupt, treasonous, tyrannical, or all of the above at the same time. Now, in this video, which I've never seen before, it came out about two years ago, but I've never seen it, uh, a man walks in with a ripped up thin blue line flag and it takes the officers um, about five seconds to realize what the flag is and then another five seconds to tell everybody, come on. And within 10 seconds, um, the little foyer where he was standing in had about 20 police officers in it and uh, they were giving him a new set of bracelets. Now. Back in the 80s and 90s, Americans were burning flags. It's not the first time they burned flags. I'm sure they did it in the Vietnam War. But it came to a head in the 80s and 90s in which the case went all the way up to the Supreme Court for desecration of the flag. And the Supreme Court ruled that it's a citizen's right under freedom of speech, freedom of expression, to burn the American flag. That's what the Supreme Court upheld. So surely... An American citizen can tear a thin blue line flag. Well, not in Leon Valley. You can't. Watch. You got tools too? There you go. Pretty good, huh? Glad you're cheering. There you go, man. Love your fruit. Sorry, man. Have a good day. <laughs> you're under arrest for the fucking highway. Get back. Okay. Get back now. Okay. Hold on. Stop, stop. Over here. All y'all okay. witnesses to the crime. All y'all witnesses to the crime. All y'all witnesses to the crime. Hold on. What are you doing? Oh, right. so we're we're confiscating your camera. We're going to do a crime. We're going to give a lock order. Turn around. 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 Wrong. Cameras evidence you're taking your camera. Camera. Yeah. You're taking your camera. Evidence. For what? For evidence. Why? Evidence of a crime. Let go. If anybody knows who's, who that man is, please put his name or his link in the description if he has a YouTube channel. I saw it on Pinnack. Uh, photo photography is not a crime. Uh, it's a Facebook page, but I don't know who those people are. If you could put it in my... The link in my description so I could give him the pop proper credit because I've looked and I cannot find. Now, um, I started a movement called the Manger Flag in which we ask, the American people ask that uh, the American flag and only the American flag be placed on all public buildings, properties, and uniforms. That's not, that's not too crazy to ask since we own all that stuff. you think... We'd want our flag on there because the thin blue line flag is an extremely um, selfish flag. Take all that adulation. Take all that love that you have for the American flag, the one that makes 60, 70, 40, 50, 30 year old men and women cry at ball games while they put their hands over their heart. Take all that adulation that people have paid the ultimate sacrifice for and then twist it a little and now say this is just about us. This is our flag. Give us all that love. Give us all that adulation. It's pretty demented. Anyways, uh, these decals right here are demand your flag decals. It's void over the thin blue line flag. It says on all the people's properties, buildings, and uniforms. Hashtag demand your flag. The link is in the description to get them if you want them. But remember, the American flag should be the only flag ever displayed on properties, buildings, and and uniforms. Certain, f furthermore, the Supreme Court's upheld that burning an American flag falls under freedom of expression, freedom of speech. So surely him wiping his feet with a thin blue line flag would, but I think when that lady came in behind him, they used that as a way that he was obstructing, right? He was obstructing that lady getting in the building, which is ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. It was retaliatory. Leave your comments below. Tell me what you think. And my name is the Soy Product News. Wishing you and yours a very safe and happy rest of the work week. Good night.